Sculptures celebrating the human body, precious jewelry, animals, and deities are all on show. The exhibition avoids the Maya's best-known legacy, their spectacular architecture around Central America, to concentrate on their portrayals of more personal things, such as religion and clothes. We show here under the title Maya: Sprache der Schönheit. The exhibition is titled "The Maya Language of Beauty," and we are showing 300 pieces that show how the Maya artists created sculptures of people and animals. The pieces span almost 2,000 years, from 500 BC until 1500 AD. So about 2,000 years are collected here with these 300 objects. Sponsored by the Mexican National Institute of Anthropology and History, the exhibition has been on show at museums in Mexico and Beijing, but the German capital is Europe's only stop. I don't think this will be completely different and new for a European audience. The Maya culture is well known and famous. We are talking about one of the most important civilizations, not only in America but the world. And because of this fame, people will most likely come and visit, because they already have an expectation of the wonderful art that was created by the Maya civilization. The exhibition also explores the importance of clothing in signaling social status, and features jewelry such as necklaces and earplugs in jade and chrysoprase. No, you can't say that something is specific to Mayan art, but rather the range is specific to Mayan art. The Mayan artists used a whole variety of materials, techniques, and languages of art, and this is precisely what characterizes Mayan art: this whole diversity. This richness of the art would be the defining Mayan characteristic. The exhibition is particularly important as the traditional Mayan culture and civilization has mostly disappeared, and little is still known about it. The show runs from April 12 to August 7. Shen Li, CCTV.